Hi there. This is next week's weather forecast for the UK 2019. If you like this music and this video, please give me a thumbs up. And as they say, here we go. So this is a place called Leeds today. This is the up air temperature. Now what we're interested in here, what we're looking at, um, is the, the temperature down to minus 10 to 15. Um, of the upper air temperature then we really are in the freezer now it is going up here near the minus 10 or I think the minus five, well, not minus 5 to 10 cells smart so that's quite a mild smell it's the warmest mild smell I've had since um, before Christmas last year but it's only a blip of warm it's nothing really it's nothing it's going to go below stay around about this mark here with the white line the uh, minus 5 mark now some about three computer models are about three to two going down to minus ten, roughly. But this is northern England, and this is not unusual. So that's that. And there are some rain small spikes, rainfall spikes, especially around about the um, the sort of the first of February, end of January onwards in Leeds. There are a few low ones here, but it's staying quite dry. Getting quite concerned about this drama we're having at the moment. We're not getting a lot of rain across the United Kingdom. And if that, that continues, uh, we could have some major problems with water situation again across the United Kingdom again this year. Um, but that's something to worry about further on into the future. So that's that. This is the um, upper sea temperatures across the world globally. So this is a weak El Nino here. And uh, we all to play for all the sea temperatures around the world globally. Um, it's all going on. So watch this and see how it goes. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. So uh, sea temperatures set here. I've got a warmer south of Greenland lately into this year. We've got a warmer. That's interesting. Very interesting. The sea temperatures down here seem to be getting warmer too now. Very interesting. Very interesting. That's that. This is the GFS computer model prediction. See what's going on here. This is the, what we call a mild outlook with the weather. Wow, it's one of the mild output computer models. It's a storm coming in. Looks like a storm around the 27th of January with a north easterly wind at the end of it. It's the 29th, 28th of January. And then we got a uh, northwesterly wind, 29th of January onwards. Well, it ends to the end of January if this is correct. And uh, it stays unsettled with a westerly wind there. That's a northeasterly. That's quite a nasty storm that looks like to me on the 1st of February. If this computer all is right, what to look out for? A northerly wind, northeasterly, cold, very cold. We might have some snow around about the 3rd or 4th of February or 2nd, maybe. Look out for snow next week, guys. Take care. And then look, we're south of the jet stream by the 7th of January. High pressure building over us. If this team looks right. Westerly winds, quite mild. So that's that. And this is the light potential across Europe. There's a lot of thunderstorms in Greece and across the Mediterranean. There's quite a lot going on with the weather around the world globally. Um, well, 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 and England and all that. And the world well, globally, if you know what I mean. Well, European weather wise. So, if you like this video and this video, please give me a thumbs up. May the force be with you always. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. Please keep safe and uh, enjoy the uh, um, the mild weather while we've got it for the next few days. And it's cold next week and freezing cold. Thank you for listening. A big freeze is on its way from the 11th of February onwards. Thank you for listening. So I'm going to speak. Bye. Bye.